Welcome back to Mario Monday. How we all doing? So, kind of where we left off is we got the elevator key. So let's go up the elevator so that way we can go over the track and actually get across the bridge to go to the next place where we get the crystal star. <gasps> Hold on, can we? I guess we can't. Yeah, it looks like we can't. All right, elevator key. We just jumping right in the Mario Monday. We're not wasting any time. This looks like drop frames. This is definitely dropped frames. <laughs> Hurry up and get off the elevator. <laughs> oh my gosh. Mario darling. What on earth are these hopping creatures? I don't know either. Why are we still dropping frames? Perhaps these things are responsible for flipping that switch. We must hurry and find it so we can switch it back. Seriously though, what is going up with my frames? Is it all these creatures? Is that what the frames are? Frame problem is? Let's try blowing some of them off screen and see if it starts improving. Oh my gosh. Go away, you're ruining the gameplay. <laughs> Is it going faster at all? I feel like it's slowly speeding up. Like not as many frames are being dropped. Oh my gosh, how many of these do I gotta blow away? It was seriously running fine until we hit the elevator. Okay, they're all running away. Maybe once they're all gone, it'll control smoothly again. That's right, go away. Go away. You're ruining the gameplay. All of you. I think they're still around. Let's go hit the switch. Oh my gosh, what is going on? Why <laughs> is it so framey? It doesn't actually feel like it's framey. It just feels like it's slow-mo. It feels like the frames are fine. It's just the processing is slow. And now we're back to normal speed with this. Oh my gosh. This ROM or my computer or the emulator or something does not like that basement. <laughs> okay, now it likes the basement. Oh, is there anything else that we could look for or look at? Nothing overhead. Okay, well now that's running smoothly again. Uh, let's go back up the elevator. Okay, so this is where it got framey last time, which is being on the elevator. Landed okay. Getting on and off the elevator just doesn't work no matter what. Hold on, we're gonna go in here and see if that resets it. Yeah, the game doesn't like the elevator, I think it is. Go through the door. And we're back to normal speed, okay. Yeah, it's the elevator. Something does not like the elevator at all. Well, let's get back on the train now that we're done with that frame dropping. Hey, thanks a lot, Mario. Now we'll get you guys rolling. The day is just passing you by. Hurry, all aboard. Everybody, have a good trip. Thanks, Toad. I'll take your advice and get back on the train. I got an email. Well, the train's gonna have to wait. This email is much more important. I got three VP points that I'm not using. Uh, 
50 plus. Pretty lucky. When your allies attacked, when your allies attack causes foes sometimes to miss. Double drain. Wear this, you'll be able to use two items during Mario's. I don't care about that. HP dream. Drop Mario's attack power by one, but regain one HP per attack. No. No. Mega Rush. Increase in attack power by five when your partner is in peril. No. Mobilize an enemy. No. Tornado jump. I wish you could damage. Hold on. Wear this to use Tornado Jump 3 required to use this attack, which can damage all midair enemies. If executed superbly, wearing two or more. Uh, I don't care. Hammer throw. Hmm. Hammer throw seems like a good one. I don't know, though. This seems like a good one to have. Wait, which can make foes soft if executed. Super oh, okay. I was about to say, you just stomp on them and it doesn't do as much damage? That's kind of dumb. Because it is, and that's not what it does. Uh, decrease damage by one when a guard command is now. I don't really use guard that much. Let's see. I guess we could do... I don't really want to do close calls because it calls for you to have to be in damage first. Be in danger first. I kind of want it just to cause missing like constantly throughout the whole entire battle. That's what I would prefer. Um, I don't like my badges, if I'm being completely honest. Drop damage. Yeah, I don't like these. These are trash. I guess I'll put that on because I think, yeah, I had that on for Mario. So everybody will regain health throughout battles. And I didn't read the email. <laughs> that was the whole reason for me stopping. King K. What's up, dog? Yo, G Money, it's me, King K. Your homie from the Glitz Pit. I know you remember me, dog. Uh, oh, yeah, this is the Koopa. How you doing? What? You off KO and fools left and right somewhere else. I'm still living large in the minor league, but I'm keeping busy. You know how it is. I gotta thank you again for convincing me to stay, dog. You fired me up good. So, are we ever gonna chill again, or what? Or are we just gonna meet in the ring? Careful, dog. Next time you in front of King K, I'm gonna be way, 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 way better. Keep it real, King K. Look at him. Yeah. I was kind of confusing for Rock Hawk for a minute there. Ah, the board! Okay, we get on. Sound to ride a strain. Let's go! I wonder if there's going to be any more mysteries to appear this time on the train, or are we just going to end up in a place? There's kind of not more train left to explore. There's plenty of mysteries that you have added on. But I just don't know. Bing bong, bing bong. Attention all passengers. Thank you for riding the XS Express. Our next stop is our last, Poshley Heights. Um, are we allowed to leave our room? We're not being trapped here against our will? Ghost is still in here and I don't have to hide for him to come out. We'll be in Poshley Heights tomorrow. I feel sad that I won't see you after that. But please do come visit. I won't be going anywhere. Technically, you'll be going everywhere if you're on a train and the train is moving. But it's late now. Good night. Good night. I feel like there's no point in being up and walking around, so let's just get Mario to bed. So, tomorrow, we shall see Poshley Heights at long last, will we? We simply must get the Crystal Star before those others. We must. Let's get a wink of beauty sleep before then. Okay. Sleep it is. Would you like to go to bed for the night? Yep. Into bed we go. 
The train voyage, day three. Ah, a brand new morn. A cool, brisk, and, and perfect. Cool, brisk, and perfect. Oh, sleeping also restores your star power? I did not know that. Uh, looks like we gotta go see what's up somewhere. Past the time. Dining car. Oh, well, this toad is still here. Everyone else seems to be missing. The toad is sleeping. Yeah, I'm not gonna buy anything. Yeah, I, th I think everybody is missing. I bet the ghost is still in one place because I don't think he can move that from that room. What's going on here? The rat has gone to the bob -omb family. The conductor isn't blocking the back of the car. Uh-oh, what's going down? door looks like it might be open. Not quite. Yo, what's going on around here? They gotta be back in there. Someone is holding them hostage. Because they want to get to the Mario. But what will trigger a series of events? You got an email again? How many times am I going to get emails? A patch. Yo. Yo, Mario. Here's your... How's your stash? Life on the island feels great. Waking... When the sun rises, I wakey-wakey. And when it sets, I tuck her in for a snoozer time. Perfect for the simple bloke like me, right? Every now and then, that Cretan Flavio spits out some... Bit old drivel about treading water instead of season life. But I'm just... Tuning them out. Didn't Flavio go back to town? So, you off on another adventure? I think that suits you best. Give the mooligans what for and save your princess. From Papatch. Yeah, I knew it was him. Why was I getting another mail so soon, though? I just got the last one. Alright, let's get Vivian out of here. It's about to say, you gotta show up. You couldn't have disappeared like everyone else. There's a large sanctum in Poshley Heights. The picture on display there is so big. It looks like it could just jump and you could just jump aside. Oh, I get the reference. Mario 64. Really though, where is everybody? My favorite chunkster isn't here either. The last cabin that should be occupied would be this one. And she ain't in here. Because we know the zip toad was actually Duplis. And Duplis is gone. Alright. On to the front of the train. This is the only person we found other than the ghost toad. Ah, good morning, sir. It's quite quiet this morning, wouldn't you say? Huh? Is there something on the windshield? Ah. Ah! What are these things? Ah, aren't those things from the station yesterday? They must have stored away. What? First... We have to ensure that the, 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 the passenger safety. B -b 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 I have to keep driving the train. M -m 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 Mario, can you check on the p -p -p passengers? Uh, they're not there no more. They're, they're just not. We know Zip Toad is gone. They're all over this train, shoe. What was the thing? It was... There was like a story about... Like gremlins or something taking down planes. They did... Uh, 
episode of it on Bugs Bunny, I remember. I can't remember what it was called, though. But literally, like, Bugs Bunny was, like, freaking out the whole entire time because, like, he could see this thing that was trying to destroy the plane and cause them to crash, but... The music calms down the moment we step in here. But yeah, no one believed that he was actually seeing something. Okay, we already heard this part. Next room is Mario's. We know there's nothing in there. Just side check anyway in case somebody did show up and somehow run in there. So the only people in existence on this train right now are the sleeping toad, the ghost toad, and the train engineer. You know, I think we should just go back to the train car and stop dipping in everybody's rooms. We know they're not in there. Here we go. Smork, 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 smork. What is a smork thing? No! They've gotten inside the train cars. You have to clear them out. And I know just how to do it. But hurry! Oh, we can already see the waitress. Oh, they have the poor conductor. How horrible. Please help him. I feel like they got everybody, don't they? Wah! Oh, he seems to be good now. Just a little shaken up. Ah, uh, Detective Mario. You saved us again. Hey, I must have been taken by those black things while I was sleeping. Scary. They seem to have come into the baggage car through the open window and they still have many of the our pink passengers all those poor souls so I gotta get up there and get them I see how we do it yeah and out we go do I gotta blow them away or do I gotta actually fight them oh good lord Oh, they're kind of like pushing us off the train, but we gotta keep blowing them off anyway, make space for ourselves. That's right, keep moving, keep moving. Get out of here. Get out of here. You're not welcome on this train. Oh, they just keep popping up. You just gotta keep pushing forward, huh? Only problem is, we're blowing them all away, but they're gonna end up somewhere else for someone else to deal with. I guess just keep blowing away and pushing forward. Gosh, there's so many. At least we know it's the elevator that's slowing us down, because if all those guys in the basement were slowing us down, oh, we'd be hopeless right now. My friends would be dead. How are we supposed to find anybody? How much effort do I have to go in, put into finding people? My gosh. Smorg. They're leaving. I guess we got far enough. And now we just got to battle a big bunch of them, I guess. Ah, like an octopus. Hey, it's everybody else. Hi, everybody. What is that foul thing? Oh my! Mario, look, it's got the other passengers! Help! Back! Uh, we'll try to get you. S'more! 
All right, a phase on. Bring it. All right, what would be the best way to damage this joint? I'd imagine a hammer. Let's try head rattler. That did nothing. This might be all on flurry. Gale force. Oh my gosh. How do you attack this thing? Ow. Did a block on it. Really, how am I supposed to attack this? What do I do? That's a rock. Get out of here. What do I do? 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 Tactic, swap partner. Goombella. Give us the lowdown. Tattle. That's a smorg. Lots of smorgs gather to create the, this huge monster. HP is 50, attack is 5, and the defense is 1. It attacks with its weird tentacles. Defeating the tentacles will be will drop its body defense to 0, making it easier to attack. And the tentacles will regenerate. The tentacles will regenerate. But use that time to deal tons of damage, okay? It may also take other forms with higher attack powers. I don't really know. Let's just hurry and beat this thing down so we can save those trapped passengers. So I think we gotta jump. So let's go with attack by stomping on enemies with a giant jump. No, it's only gonna hit the one. Dang! This can't do that much. Uh, yeah, my timing is just off. I can't get it right. Shoot. I gotta send someone else out. I know who to send out. All right, so first let's swap and we're going to do Kid Yoshi. Why? Because this is easy. This will be another one down. No, it doesn't have enough attack power. Are you kidding? Oh, it's defense is one. Kid Yoshi, why are you so useless? Worry would probably be the best choice then. Oh my gosh, I'm so bad at blocking. Who's throwing? No, get out of here. Swap partner. I think Flurry is the best one to go with. All right, Flurry. Body slam into it. That one missed. All right, now we can get to just attacking. Sweet. And then, boom. And then it's just the main body. Let's go ahead and Yes And now lip lock I didn't get out of you that was my first time using it 
And we're back to this again. Ah, no. They can start to take Flurry out right now. Oh, boy. All right, so let's go with... I think I want to do Art Attack. No, I needed to do a little bit more to get the last tentacle. All right, let's do... Let's do this. Flurry, go ahead and heal up. I need your attack power. Now I actually want to do one other thing, because I think this might actually do us some good. Bobbery, get out of here. And let's do Bomb Squad. I didn't even see that someone was throwing some. How disrespectful. There we go. All right, and then Mario, get the jumping. Dang, I miss. Uh, hold fast, damage enemies that attack Bobbery directly. Attack all enemies with a massive blast. Let's give this a try. That's kind of a waste. Ooh. Thank you, Boo. Boo's really are friendly. Wait. They're all too far. Are you kidding me? Let's try it. It's a nice 10. Bomb. And we're back with the tentacles again. At least we know that his bombs can actually hurt the tentacles. Ha! Thank you, Boo. All right, so normal jump. And then let's go. Hey, nice. There, that should help out. Dang, I keep missing the buttons. Who throwing what? A can? No, get out of here. Stupid Goomba. Now let's go ahead and... Let me get this back one. Miss! Bomb Squad. Come on, next attack, next attack. Keep missing. Uh-huh. Yes. And then the rest of the bombs. Miss. Miss. Take them. Can I catch a break with all that? Wait. Nice five.
Oh, we get to attack again? Sweet. All right, piercing blow again. 10 more damage. Yeah, I don't want the poison mushroom. Why would I want that? Might have to go through one more cycle with all this. Oh, no. It's the last defense cycle. Oh, shoot. Mario is about to die. Wait a minute. What if we... Perfect. And then... Yes! I didn't have to use any items to heal. I was worried that I was going to have to. Because, of course, Mario's sitting here on 2 HP. Or 3. Oh, now you give me this? You mean it's in the middle of the battle. What'd I pay 100 coins for? <laughs> Increase your star points. Oh, wait, what? Really? <gasps> oh, snap. I love that curse ability. Or blessing ability, whatever you want to call it. What did I say I was going to do last time? What did I say I was going to do last time? Um... I'm going to health again. I think I might have said flower power last time. I'm going to health again. Smork, smork, smork. Yeah, that's right. Go away. All you guys. I'm trying to ruin everyone's day. Everyone's just trying to go someplace. Thank you. Boy, it's like all you did for three days was save us. How could we ever thank you? Everyone's safe now. It's all thanks to you. Oh, thank you much. You saved my life. No, stupid tongue of mine. You saved my life. So, did you know? Did you all know? This dashing fellow has been the famous Luigi all along. We'll soon arrive at Poshley Heights. Ladies and gentlemen, please prepare to disembark. How come no one bothered to correct him? No one bothered to say, actually, this is Mario. The famous brother. The more famous brother. Hey, <laughs> gum. Bing bong, bing bong. Sorry, goes my blinds. Attention all passengers. Now arriving at Poshley Heights. Please watch your step and be sure to take all your belongings with you. And thank you for choosing the XS Express. We made it, old boy. Let's find that Poshley Sanctum that Professor Frankly spoke of. Post haste. Okay, now that I turn on my lamp, I will do so. Ah, what an adventure all that was. What an adventure all that was indeed. And here's the exit. Glad to be rid of this train. We have a bit of time until our next departure. If we were to go on another departure, would something happen? So that would possibly be worth looking into. Look at Poshley Heights. Wow. Swanky. The business people I'm waiting for haven't arrived yet, so I'm sightseeing. On the expense account, of course. As if you have to ask by now. Yeah, no, I know. You're using all your company's money. We'd dearly like to find a suitable present for little bub. You wouldn't happen to have a train set for sale, would you? A gold one, perhaps. Hey, mister. I'm going to get a train set. The coolest one ever invented. I could just have them buy me a real train. But maybe I'll save that for next year. Gosh, what a spoiled family. Water? Why is that in the pool? I found a lovely star piece. 
But really, why is that in the pool? Whose house are we in? Hold up. Why is there a hole upstairs, but you can't get to the upstairs? Hold up. Something's off here. Upstairs region, you can't get to it. There's this one little discoloration on the wall. What is up with this place? Oh, is there someone else I could use for all this? Nope. Wait. I do have an ability, though. That nah, didn't work. What's up with the ups upstairs? Where's the bedroom? Where do people sleep? Uh, we guess we can check out this house. Hold on, what's up with... What's it? Okay. I guess this place just looks nice. It isn't actually... Is this your place? Welcome, you marvelous man. The train journey certainly was thrilling. I mean, I guess you could say that when you were abducted with everyone else. Uh, is there anything going on upstairs? No, just a table and chairs. Not even a bed. Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. I see a fan. I blow. Okay, then. I guess I'm just ahead of my time in thinking. All right, to the next region of this posh place. Hey, it's a penguin. Welcome to you. How do you like to buy some high quality fresh pasta as a posh souvenir? How can you buy pasta as a souvenir? One package costs 50 coins out, but no. Come again, okay? Not at that price. We are the Wandering Girls, the Traveling Sisters 3. We're staying in that luxury hotel. Poshly High sure is a place for the rich and famous, huh? We're thinking of going to see Poshly Sanctum next. I thought I'm going there. I'd heard Poshly Heights was a quiet place. There's a lot of tourists, eh? Maybe I should just open up a store selling sh Shiver City souvenirs? Yeah, maybe so. Is that where you're from? I thought there would be something back here. What about back here? Whose house is this? That's the next question. Wait, can we run alongside the house? I guess it's sort of fun to live here. But I can't eat snow cones. Or make little snowmen. Or go ice skating. Or any of the stuff I did in Shiver City. Eh? Don't know what you got till it's gone. So lovely house, eh? Yeah, sure. Take your time to soak in all of its majesty. I built it with even the smallest details in mind, making every nook special. Not only the interior, but the facade as well. Yeah, look around outside too. Did you have to describe it as a facade? Is that you trying to just be fancy with it? Um, sir, I can't go past this facade. I guess it's as far as the facade goes. There's a hotel. Is there a lot to see in the hotel? Welcome, sir. This is the Royal Poshley Park Tower. We promise a comfortable stay in the lap of luxury and the pinnacle of poshness. A room for the night costs a mere 30 coins. Now pass. We look forward to your next visit, sir. What's up, you? Bonjour, Monsieur Moustache. The last at the reception desk is très magnifique. Magnifique. I shall stay here every night until that heart is mine. I shall not tire. Huh? Can I go up the elevator? I can! Oh, I'm exploring this joint. Oh, it's not slowing down. Nice! Where are the floors? I guess this is all there is to see. 
Hold up. What's there to do in this room? There's nothing to do. This is pointless. <laughs> I love doing that. I love lo losing my partner in games. I like doing it in the Pokemon games too, like Pokemon Coliseum. Uh, all the later ones where your partner follows behind you. I always love doing it. I love doing it with Pikachu too, like leaving it up on a ledge and it just gets impatient up there. I don't know why I like doing it. It's such a horrible thing to do. Oh my gosh, all this space and nothing to do with it. All right, I guess on to the Sanctorum. Another penguin. May not look like it, but I get pretty stressed out. Like, really bad, eh? But walking barefoot on the grass like this makes me feel much better. You betcha. Care to join me, guy? Well, I'm already walking on the grass. People ask me if I get tired of walking the same route every day. I say, no way, Jose. Because it's a bit different every day, you know? I'm not the same as I was yesterday. Neither are you. Even the town changes. And you'll never see another day like today. So treat each day like it's like it is unique. Okay. Hey there, Poshley Heights. It's sure nice and warm, eh? Yeah, I dig it here. Cold places make me sneeze. Why are so many penguins here? Poshley Sanctum is a rather famous building, eh? And the painting inside isn't the only gorgeous thing. So is the building. I can just stare at it all day. You betcha. Uh. Oh wait, now I know. <laughs> Boom! Shine spread away, and the door is locked. Oh, is there something tipped over here? No. Gone traveling. Sanctum manager. Oh, how unfortunate! What shall we do? Ah, this is my dear Luigi. What are you doing at my doorstep, young fellow? You still got it wrong, stupid penguin. Pardon? You live here? So you're the Sanctum Manager? My dear, I thought you were a bad detective. Well, yes. That is more like a hobby of mine, if the truth must be told. But enough chatter, hmm? Shall we go inside? I would love to go inside. How come he just unlocks it and then we go in first? Shouldn't he go in first? Oh, that's not good. That's not good at all. Wee hee 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 hee! You're one step too late! We have the Crystal Star! Hey! Don't leave without me! Yo, he busted a window! Oh my, no! We're too late! We must go after them! Just a second there, Luigi. Exactly what is going on here? Speak quickly! Hmm, yes. Quite rudimentary. So you're looking for the crystal star in the sanct sanctum. Oh, yes. Very interesting. Well, no cause for worry. Crystal star is safe. Yes, quite safe indeed. The stone that our rude friend stole was unfortunately a red herring. A fake. The real one is hidden somewhere in the sanctum to prevent such a theft. However, as to the location of the real crystal star... Well, as Sanctum Manager, of course, I am, of course, prohibited from telling anyone. However, I do know where it is. Of that, you can be most certain. Yes, indeed. Besides, I'm sure a junior detective like yourself could find it on your own. Now, Luigi, put all that... Put to use all that razor-sharp sleuthing skills I have taught you. Make me proud. It's in the painting. Yeah, we gotta go to the painting. Or could be. Oh, I want to go through the window too. Oh, let's do this. Boom. Uh, I don't see anything this way, so let's go this way with it. 
guess we just got yep we just follow all the markers where there's a red star it is hidden away but we give you a path genius simply genius uh-huh and then we go to this little spot wind up jump boom and we go over here and we turn to a paper airplane and glide I'm like a paper airplane I'll only fly away I listened to the Nelly Potato song before I streamed I listened to a few Nelly Potato songs I've just been I don't know enjoying it lately And here we are. To the button. A pipe that leads inside the painting. Sadly, we cannot just jump into the painting like, say, uh, Super Mario 64. Ah, uh, in we go. This is gonna lead to another sanctum. Yeah. With purple booze. Ah, uh ah, -huh. ah, uh ah. -huh. Ah, no. Please. Wait, this is like a mirror dimension, isn't it? Hey, we got it. Oh, baby, we got it. Star power is now seven, and Mario can use the special attack, Showstopper. That seemed a little too easy. Like, there wasn't a final battle. It was like more like a mid-level boss and then this. Mario found the six crystal star hidden craftily in the Poshly Heights Sanctum. Now only one crystal star remains, but our hero still does not know where Princess Peach is being held. Where could the last crystal star be? Where is Princess Peach being held? Hoping this crystal star might yield answers, Mario and friends return to Pennington. But yeah, it looks like that painting was literally a mirror dimension. Like the little star thing on the floor was the exact same place. Wait. No, I don't want to battle you. I want to. Yeah, I want to do this. There's a Luigi badge. Is that how we can turn into Luigi? And then Pennington will be right? Wait, is Pennington just that big of a Luigi fan? Oh, I gotta make sure there's nothing over here, too. There is! There's a shine sprite. Shine bright like a shine sprite. And now we make our way over to this. Dang, I messed up. Let's try that again. And then I'll want to check the other side. Change Luigi Mario's clothes into Luigi's clothes. <laughs> Let's go. Oh yeah. I'm trying to see if there's anything on the other side. I'm not really seeing anything. However, I do know. Wait, can I just. Okay, cool. I don't have to go back down to the floor and have to deal with all the booze. That just sounds like an alcohol problem. All right, and then over to this side. It's got to be more over here, right? I don't think there's anything left to get over here, actually. It looks like just the paper plane thing to which we didn't even... We don't need to use it. Oop. And... Yeah, we don't need to use this. I'll do it anyway, but there's not really a point. 
Swan dive. Let's try one of these battles, see what they're like. The purple booze. Already dead? I could probably farm these guys up a bit. Uh, that's fan freaking fantastic. Look, we turned to Luigi and we're already mess dealing with ghosts and messing up. Oh, yeah. Really, there should be like a paper Luigi game. Like, make a Luigi's Mansion, but make it a whole paper event. That would be dope. Or like something like that has you playing as Luigi. Having the vacuum at some point as well. It would just be so cool. Well, it looks like there's nothing left to do in here, so let's return to our penguin friend. Yeah, it said end of chapter, but we kind of already are still here. Hmm. So that's where it was. Oh, we're nothing. Nothing. Just talking out of my brain. All geniuses do it. Congratulations, Luigi. Now that's a little bit more accurate. You have found the real crystal star. So please, feel free to take it. I will put another fake one over here. Well, traveling with you has been rather hectic, but I do admit, rather fun as well. I'm sure you'll have a long road ahead, Luigi, but do not give up. Yeah, Luigi's just like his favorite Mario, bro. It has to be. There's no other explanation. Is there really nothing else to do here? We're just kind of walking out of the place? Oh, is this where the cutscene begins? Of either Bowser or Princess Peach. And the x knots Princess Peach and the x knots What is the matter with you idiots? Falling, falling for a fake crystal star. That's asinine. Sorry, dude. I mean, sir. So let me guess. Guess. This means Mario managed to get the real crystal star. Uh, I'm gonna say, maybe? Ugh. This mustache menace has nearly every crystal star now. They were mine! I think I'd better alter my plan a bit. Before you do, Sir Grotus, I think I'd better tell you something. What is it, fool? Mumble, mumble. What? Are you sure? Speak! No joke, dude. I mean, affirmative, sir, dude. That is... I'm positive, sir. Ugh. Treason! It's only about tech. Strange. Isn't it about time for tech to call me in? Maybe he's busy. Oh! Here we go! I wouldn't do it. You about to get caught. It's about to be bad! Who knew that x not would be smart enough to call out Tech's problem? Hello, Tech. What do you want today? Princess Peach, I have... I have reached a conclusion. A conclusion? I have struggled with whether to obey orders or to speak to you. And I cannot confirm what I should believe. Tech... You don't sound right. What's going on with you? Princess Peach, please escape from this place as quickly as possible. Escape? Tech, what do you mean by that? I mean, why all of a sudden? The data you procured has been analyzed and something terrible is... No, I will not say, but I... I have found out everything about Grotus's plans. Grotus's plans? You mean about conquering the world? Yes. And among those plans was the reason why you are being held here. According to the data.
Why did they shut the door if no one's busting through it? No! No way! It's impossible! I don't believe it! Yes, everything is true. That is why you must escape from here as fast as possible. But how can I do that, Tech? I mean, I don't even have the slightest idea where I am. I will not hide anything anymore. No, not from you. I will tell you everything. The place where you are currently imprisoned. This is the moon. The moon? You mean the moon that hangs up in the sky at night? That moon? That is correct. But that's unbelievable. How in the world am I supposed to escape? There is a way. You can escape, but you must follow my instructions exactly. But, Tech, don't they know that you helped me? Will you get in trouble? That is inconsequential. I would like you to be safe. That is all that matters. Tech. I am Basis Computer. I am the Basis Computer. No one will know of your escape if I keep silent. Please do not worry about me. Escape. Escape. And quickly. As quickly as possible. Okay, Tech. But I must inform Mario about all this before I go. This is no longer just my problem. Understood. Hold it right there, Princess Peach. Peek! You! Tech! You miserable machine! We all know that you're up what you're up to, traitor. Sir Crotus, I... In my most paranoid moments, I never thought my own computer would betray me. Well, it doesn't really matter in the end, I suppose. Especially since it ends here. You monster! What are you planning to do with him? <laughs> Only one thing to do with a malfunctioning computer. Cut the circuit and delete all the programs and data that caused the malfunction. Obviously, all data relating to Princess Peach must go as well. Yes, we must be absolutely sure nothing like this ever happens again. No, I am... I am normal. There is no malfunction. Pipe down, Tech. x knots. At the same time, press the red buttons on Tech's side. Got it, sir. Tech, no! Mail sent. Princess Peach. I. I. Oh. The. 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 Deletion completes. Sick! Gah, gah, gah. Too bad, Princess Peach. Tech is no longer with us. No, you inhuman beast. How could you? Princess Peach, just stop it. This is no time to be worrying about a computer. We have some very important things for you to do now. Yes, very important. <laughs> Save all progress up game progress up to this point. Yes. Save and do not touch the memory card in slot A. There is no slot A. This is a computer program. <laughs> of course, Bowser. Oh, we finally get that chest down now. <laughs> He's so defeated. I've got no crystal stars. Can't find Princess Peach. Twilight Town was, well, wasn't exactly glorious. What's going on here? This keeps up. Mario's gonna steal everything from my grasp, as usual. 
Your massiveness. We did it. The Magic Koopa Scouts found a suspicious underground chamber. It isn't even on the maps. Yeah, really suspicious. Something must be there. Huh. About time. Well done. This is where it all turns around for me. Definitely. The Hammer Bros Battalion are attempting to breach the chamber at this moment. The area is impenetrable. They're scraping tooth and nail in there. No problem. Break me there. I'll blast us through. I'm Bowser, baby. So he's going to the Crystal Star Chamber? Luigi! He just walks away. Wow. Ready to roll. Oh, we got one of these again. Oh, come on. I jumped. You just ain't got no headspace. Let me out. Boom, here we go again. Boom, 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 boom. Made it. Oh, there go the fire. Eh, 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 eh. Aha. Made it. Oh no, they shrunk me. I thought it was gonna be my full size. Hold up. I can't do anything there. Wait, can I shrink? Can't shrink? Wait, what if, what? There we go. You had to shrink down. Can't do anything there. Oh, we ended up in another world? Right, come down to my loser. What if I never took the trampoline? How much different would it be? Finish! I don't feel like it should be finished, though. A gym. This is the secret chamber that they couldn't... Incredible, Lord Bowser. Nothing stood in your way. You couldn't be more super. Actually, lava stood in my way. Please. No problem. I felt right at home. But where are we now? Gracious me. Look, Lord Bowser, from the wall behind you. Oh, uh, this is Rock Hawk's place. And that is not the real Crystal Star because we already got the one. Hello. Could it be? Oh, yeah. A Crystal Star. Advantage Bowser. <laughs> At last, we found one. And now, we'll make it ours. Freeze, chumps. Grah, who's there? Ha ha ha. Don't you know me? Don't tell me you don't know the famous Rock Hawk. You little punk weasel. You forgot these muscles. You forgot this hugeness. Don't ask me how. But you cleared my secret training facility. Not too shabby. I even imported some super freaks to up the difficulty level. You're good. You hired x -Nots? Of course. Don't. Uh, good don't count for, for squatting this biz, baby. The champ's belt is mine. Grah. Oh, look. What an adorable little weakling. Hi, fella. Weak? Wait, what? Well, tell me something. You ever see Weakling do this? Bane. Ouch. Oh, now you're sleeping. I knew it when you were, I knew you were a Weakling. What? The Crystal Star. Hmm? Eek, it's split in two. Oh no, 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 no. Wait, hold the phone. My mighty, lo mighty Lord Bowser, this is just glass. It's a flip flam, a fake. What? What? Speak English. You, ow, want the real one? The great R Gonzalez has it. Oh, my aching head. Feel the rock. 
I don't know anybody named Gonzalez. Stop speaking in riddles, you chicken nugget. Crud! Who do I have to flatten to get the crystal star? Who? Who? Uh, Mario has it. Saving all progress up to this point. The progress was saved. I guess we could do a little cutscene of making it back, and then I'll end it off. How did I turn this train around? I guess I got an off screen station. Hey, there's no cutscene. Oh, wait, there's a mail. Oh, Mario, something tells me that you just got a love letter from your adorable princess. Well, I guess we should answer it. Mario, I know where I'm being held. I'm on the moon. Yes, the moon that floats in, out in space. I've learned something even more horrifying. In order to resurrect the monster spirit, they need my... Oh my! The moon? Mercy. What an odd place for a princess to be. Is it really? Think about it. A moon princess? Doesn't sound too far-fetched. As far as sci-fi goes. How marvelous! But why is her email cut off? Gracious! Might something have happened to her? That's exactly what happened. Something happened to her. Well, this is awkward. I'm just gonna save. Save all game progress up to this point. Yep. Save and do not touch the memory card in slot A or the power. Yeah, progress has been saved. And that's gonna be it for this one. Thank you for watching the Green Brothers. Until next time, deuces. So I wrote it in the rhyme. The Reverend Doctor got an AK, wet working. The roaches get the rays spray. My weak rhyme, my body, your best verses on game day. I touch the crowns of self entitled kings. You leave the heat like LeBron when I melt your idols, vital things. This is Malcolm and Martin, million man marching Sparta, mixed with a legion of angels surrounding sons and daughters. Simon Peter with a desert eagle waving it at Caesar. So if